Hi, welcome to Galen Catholic, our virtual tour of preschool. My name is Mrs. Schreiner, and I'm gonna give you a tour of the room today. First of all, I'd like to tell you that I only have preschool in here for half of the day, and then the other half of the day, I also teach our English as a second language program. Any of our students that are in here in the morning and are staying for the entire day, get to go over to Mrs. Bickford's room and spend the afternoon there. Hello, my name is Mrs. Bickford and I am the all day preschool teacher here at Galen Catholic. Welcome to our virtual um, preschool open house. We are bummed that we can't physically see the students and to have them come into our classroom, but we hope you enjoy this virtual tour of our classroom and we can't wait to see you in the fall. At Galen Catholic School, we have three preschool options for all families. Option number one is um, statewide voluntary, which is free from eight o'clock until 11 o'clock. So all students will be able to come free for that portion of the Option day. number two is from eight to 11.30. From 11 to 11.30, that's where we add the religion portion of it. And that is where a little bit of cost is gonna come for the religion portion. Option number three is where students stay all day. So students are able to come from eight in the morning until 3.15 in the afternoon. Um, it is free from 8 to 11 o'clock again, and then once you go after 8 or 11 o'clock from that 11 to 11.30, we add religion, and then that's when we get into our afternoon portion of the day where we have lunch, we have rest, and we have lots of playtime. This is the Art Center, Art and Writing Center, actually. Our kids really enjoy coming here. They get to play with Play-Doh. We have our dot markers, of course, crayons. They can color pre-printed pictures. They can create their own thing. We also have a little tub of miscellaneous items. They can create anything they want out of those. We love to have them design their own things, be creative. And we also display their art works that they want to have put up so they can show them off to their classmates. Welcome to our block center. We have all kinds of blocks in here. We have wooden blocks and ramps that we can construct with. We have our cardboard blocks. Always a favorite, how tall can you build the tower? We have trucks, tractors, cars, railroad tracks, even for our road, we have all kinds of signs. And a big hit are our magnet tiles. Kids love to build with these. Just a little insight into our day here in preschool. Kids come in the morning, they sign in, they usually answer a question on our smart board, and then they get some time to play at the tables. Once pray, and then we have prayer. And then we have our circle time. We have our morning greeting during that time. We talk about what we're going to do for the day. After that, we have our bathroom break and then have a snack. We always have a snack each morning. After that, we have our Outdoor play, if the weather is nice enough. When it's not, we do some large movement songs here in our classroom. Then we um, have center time where the kids get to pick and choose which one of the centers they would like to go to and they can switch as they choose. There's no set thing that they have to be there the whole entire time. After center time then, we have our small group activity where the kids are split into groups and they each have an activity to work with. They're either working with myself on a skill that we're learning for the day, or they may be working on a fine motor activity. Then after group time, we have story time. Then we take a bathroom break again. Those that leave at 11 will leave then at that time. And for those that stay around until 1130, we have religion. For any of you who have some questions about what we do during religion, we talk about how God made us and we are special. We talk about how God made all the things around us. And um, for example, birds and water and air and animals. We also talk about how God made our family and gave us our senses. 
So it's very generic. It's nothing that is specific to any one religion, so to say, but very open to God making us. Welcome to our Dramatic Play Center. Um, since you weren't here today, we thought that we would uh, show you some fun different toys that are in our um, Dramatic Play Area Center. First one is lack of dress up clothes. Dress up clothes are very big in our classroom. Kids love to dress up. Um, boys and girls both love to dress up. So we have very many different um, dress up clothes for boys and girls. We have hats um, for them to dress up like a police officer. We have a bus driver. We have an astronaut, different things. Everything with the hats go along with the outfits. So they have everything that they can wear for that whole costume. Uh, we also have boys and girls separate things. So we have ties for boys to um, put on, but we also have lots of dresses and sort, different sorts of things for the girls to wear too. Another, all right, this center is one that we change out um, every couple of weeks, depending on whatever our theme of the week is or the month is. And so the one that we have right now was Junior J Post Office. So in letter people, we were talking about the letter P. And so we went and visited the post office. So after we vis visited the post office and took a tour of it, we came over here and we created a post office in our classroom for the kids to pretend to play with. This is where a lot of our academic learning takes place. This is called our carpet area is what we call it. Um, this is our smart bird. Mr. Schreiner and I both have a smart bird in our classroom. The kids are able to physically come up and touch it and to answer questions or if there's videos or different things on here. So every day we use it for um, um, a question of the day. Students come in, put away their things, and then they have to find their name and they have to answer whatever the question is. So they physically come over here, touch their name, and drag it to wherever it needs to go. Um, we watch videos, we watch different um, shows, academic shows that shows us um, whatever our themes are that we're learning upon or different things like that. So this is utilized in our classroom very often. for joining us for this virtual tour. I am so excited to meet every one of you in the fall in person. Can't wait to see you. Thank you for visiting our classrooms. Uh, Mr. Schreiner and I cannot wait to visit you and to meet you um, this fall. And we are so excited for you to come into our classroom and learn all about preschool. Thanks for visiting.